but it's kind of like a an air this is the wait room. It's kind of like an airport, so the view's nice. And let's see if the bathroom is coming. Okay. 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 Hey guys welcome back so come with me so we can try the bright light for the first time so if you don't know what the bright light is florida just opened a new train that can take you from point a to point b so basically if you don't want to drive your car or waste gas and you want to go from orlando to miami this is the best way to do it so i decided to take it because i was going to take my sister back home drive her car and then basically i park my car somewhere where i live at a parking station and I only paid $15 I was very surprised but it was $15 for the day and then the train cost me about $30 but the price for the train varies if I were to go a little bit earlier in the day it would have cost me almost $100 but I got my ticket for $30 and look at the train I was very pleasantly surprised how at how clean it was but then it also helped that it's brand new right so I was sitting at the station section by myself with four chairs with a table and you can order drinks or food which is nice and also it you don't have to worry about driving but we're going to go all the way from the beginning on how it all got started so of course I stopped at the bar right before I got on the train to get me a drink and that's what I'm drinking and after drinking I had I read some of my books a few pages then I was knocked out by the time I got home it was already 10 p.m. so let's get started on how it all began so right now I'm at the not the train station but the shuttle station that's basically going to pick you up and take you to the train or from the train either the train or the airport because you can use it for both pick you up from that's why you park your car basically you can park your car for a day or however many days you're going to be gone if you don't want to take uber and i have this weird thing with taking an uber especially when i have my own car i don't like taking ubers so um i decided to just drop my car off so the plan is i'm going to drive my sister's car down south take her there and then i'm gonna take the yellow train which is the bright light to take me back home so i drop my car off here at the shuttle place for the day and my sister's going to pick me up so I can drive her car back home and then from there I'll take the train and I'm down south to bring me over here and then I'll call the shuttle which is the Welly Park, Park shuttle there's a number you call once you are ready to be picked up and they come and pick you up and they bring you to your car so I think it's really convenient because you don't have to really pay extra for uber because i i travel a lot so i know whenever you're at the airport requesting uber to go home it's more expensive than when you're going to the airport and because i used to also try um drive uber i know they have this thing called a surge where they charge you extra so i didn't want to spend that extra money i'm cheap like that anyway so the, that's why i'm going i park my car here and just wait for them to um, my sister picked me up and then I'll take my car from here to the house later on and the reason also why I wanted to drive my car is because when I get back it's going to be quite late so I didn't want to get in the car with a stranger so late although I I always carry so you know I'm always ready but anyways I think it's just a better option plus the ticket that I have the ticket that I have was only $30 and the ticket prices are very very like it varies because different time of the day the price changes for the train the bright light because I saw one for I think it was 3 p.m. and that would have been $100 and I got the one for 8 p.m. that one was $30 so it was a huge saving for me so anyways I will see you guys later so we are at the station restaurant trying out the food. I'm sure you guys it looks so good. So I got the fried fish. Look at this. Oh, so good. Mmm. 
This is the pickles. Mm. This cost me about twenty-eight dollars, but just the fish itself is worth twenty-eight dollars. So, completely worth it. We don't eat dog or cats. This is how we eat. This is the bottom pizza. Five tension. This is the kind of food that we eat. That whole cat dog. I don't know who that is. I don't know who eats like that, but it's not Haitian. Put some respect on our name. Okay, so we just took a read. And I'll get to the stairs so that's I'm out of breath. But they do have a mini bar. Exciting. And it's kind of like a an air. This is the wait room. It's kind of like an airport, so the view's nice. And let's see if the bathroom is for me. I actually like it and I actually got a really good deal with this, these tickets to Orlando. I mean $30. That's not bad because it would have cost me a lot more in gas to get to Orlando. And plus I don't have to drive, I can sleep, I can have a drink, you know, all of that. So let's go have a drink. Food, but I don't think I'm going to eat the food that I have now, so. Oh, most likely. You know what I'm crazy? Soup. <gasps> oh, I didn't leave the thing for my brother. Thank it. You know what? He'll get another time. Oh my goodness, this is such a bad angle. <laughs> my double chin. My double chin. <laughs> to say the bathroom is very clean. I mean, it has a lot to do with the fact that it's new, but the bathroom is very clean. And I love that because I hate a nasty, dirty bathroom. Just gross. Let's go to the mini bar and go have a drink.